Okay, the first thing you want to do is turn the burner off right there. That would essentially be a reset button. Push it. And, uh, you know, if all you're doing is resetting, you just leave it off for a few minutes and turn it back on. That should get rid of the error code. Um, but if it's reading EE6, that means that uh, there's a fuel obstruction. So what you want to do is just turn it off at the button, back around, turn the fuel valve off, and <clears> then <throat> what you want to do is put a piece of plastic down here, like a trash bag on the floor, you know, put some paper towels in it and stuff, and then you take, uh, <clears throat> you know take these two screws out one on each side and you can lift the front cover off of it I just leave mine out it's easy. and then you can see inside where the pump is and then what you want to do is take a, a piece of tin foil and make a little trough so that it fits in here underneath here because what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to take these three screws out and when you do, there's going to be some fuel, small amount of fuel spills out here, and you want it to run out and catch it in a, um, you know, a little tray or something. Um, but put paper towels all around, so in case you, in fact, it's a good idea to put some around in here, too, just to keep it, in case it's not level. You don't want it spilling and running back in the back there. Okay, so inside there, there's going to be a rect uh, rectangular uh, screen. You reach in there with a pair of needle nose pliers. There's a little tab on the end facing you and you pull it out and you got to make sure, pay attention to which direction it's facing. There's a metal tab on it that should be facing towards the front. And you pull it out and <clears throat> if there's uh, scum and varnish and crap like that, you need to take it outside and clean it with like some electromotive cleaner or carburetor cleaner works really good because it dries really fast and then you put it back in put everything back together and if it's starved for fuel which is usually what happens when you hear the pump thumping really quick is because it's run out of fuel and it could be that this filter is plugged but after you uh, put it all back together you turn the fuel on you turn the power back on and you push this button right here one time real quick don't push it any more than that because you can flood it and make a mess um, but anyhow if, uh, if that's a problem it should get it going again alrighty